Hey guys, it's me, Komusan, and I gotta say something uh, about this entire situation with Real Time Studios, the people behind the Real Time FNAF fan game. And I just gotta say to the FNAF community, I am disappointing you guys. So, someone sent, uh, um, you can read it here, they said, Hey guys, I just sent goal of a all victim on my personal account. I am scared to continue on this project anymore. Thank you for the support, and this is what they said on the big old thing. I'll tell you guys how I feel afterwards. So, here's what the creator said. I've been being hurt a lot by the hate comments on the demo and how much we've put into this project. I love this, that we're open about constructive criticism about this directly, honestly, on what we expect and dislike. That's a very important and truth seeking skill that can enable us to have forward thinking and understanding conversations. But, but this is not about good and positive criticism or even passive hate comments or bad comments. I'm simply not okay and have suffered so much from simply wanting to express and sell our game with the community and more. I'm sorry for the feeling of disliking or being upset at our game demo releases or just me. I'm gonna step away until some time. So let's just turn back time right to the start and see y'all on the flip side. So, and then this posted art. So basically, a lot of people have been hating the demo for some reason, even though there's nothing really bad about it. Of course, some people are going to be upset over it for some reason, but it seems like it has, actually has been getting to the cradle of the game, and that's very disappointing to hear. I said something right down here, just take your time, stay safe for, for Roxy image. But this is very disappointing to hear. Uh, I've seen people complain about it not having shadows and stuff. It is so mind-boggling. It was a demo. And I guess people don't realize what a demo means anymore. And they bring up the conversation of Scott making the game in six months. Scott, the FNAF 1 uses PNGs for the animations. This game actually uses animations of the animatronics walking around and stuff. The only animations that actually happen in FNAF 1 is the jump scales, to be honest. And so, it, it's a lot of work. It's not going to take six months to develop. So, it's, it's such a stupid thing to complain about. And other complaints I've been seeing, but sending people stuff like that is disgusting, and I'm just very disappointed in the FNAF community, and we should support our fan game cradles like we do, like we always do, and hating on it for simply hating on it, like, there's, why do you hate the game? There's not a lot of much to hate about it. I don't see anything to hate about. Wow, the game doesn't have shadows. Is that such a deal breaker for you my god grow up you don't have to play it it's just it's something i have a big problem with the fnaf community is how toxic and hateful some of the people are i know it's not everyone in the community is like that but it's a large portion of the community and that stuff rises to the top and when you see it it just brings bad name to the community and it's just disappointing to heal as a fnaf content cradle and to see stuff like this I just want to put my two cents on it. Do not send people stuff like that. And I, the cradle can take their time however long they need. Because I will always support the game. Because they don't seem like a bad person. And the game is pretty fun. So, I don't, it's, this, it's just crazy in my opinion. But I'll see you guys next time. Proper video tomorrow, okay?